The top automotive news of the day. The Ministry of Road Transport and Highways has proposed an increase on tax on diesel cars and it is looking to have a uniform tax structure on new cars across the country. We have spy shots of the all new Hyundai Centro and finally Jaguar reveals the XE300 Sport Edition. So the Ministry of Road Transport and Highways has issued a circular which recommends that the tax on diesel cars should be increased by 2%. If this happens, then the tax rates on sub 4 meter cars with engine capacity less than 1.5 liters will reach 33%. Taxes on luxury cars can go up to 50%, and the SUVs will bear the heaviest brunt with taxes reaching 52%. The government has also proposed that the taxes be reduced for electric cars, which is a good sign. Along with increasing taxes on diesel cars, the government is also looking at having a one tax structure for all new cars across India. This will stop people from registering their cars in lesser taxed areas and using them in higher taxed ones. The government is also proposing to have one nation, one permit structure for commercial vehicles, which will result in easier movement of goods across the country. This could also result in decreased pricing of essential commodities. Hyundai has gone on record saying it will be launching the new generation Centro soon. In fact, there have been numerous sightings of the Centro's test mules across the country, which further indicates that Hyundai will launch it this year. Expected to get an 800cc or 1000cc engine, most likely carried over from the Eon, but have a fresh, bold design language. Jaguar has revealed the XE300 Sport Edition internationally with updated styling and a powerful 2-liter petrol engine which makes close to 295 brake horsepower and offers 400 newton meters of peak torque it does 0 to 100 km per hour in just 5.5 seconds